Hey everyone, this is Michael again, and just wanted to do this video. Uh, just want to talk about uh, the Splat, which is a new block that's going to be premiering on TNIC next Monday at 10 o'clock. And what this block consists of is all classic 90s Nickelodeon shows, you know, from the Nicktoons and the live action shows. And you know me, I'm a huge classic Nickelodeon fan. I like everything. Like some stuff from Nickelodeon in the 90s. You know, it's the only network as a kid that I watched all the time growing up. And, you know, with this, when this was announced, a lot of people, this was rumored to be either a 24 7, you know, channel or a block. And a lot of people wanted a 24 7 channel. Uh, me, I was, I wanted one too, but it was then announced on uh, Thursday. This past Thursday, that it was just going to be a uh, block on T Nick that's going to run from 10 o'clock at night to 6 in the morning. And you know, a lot of people were complaining about it. And you know, I don't really care though. You know, all I want to see is the classic 90s Nickelodeon shows. You know, that's it. But uh, you know, this block is going to be replacing the 90s or all that block, which you know, when it debuted back in 2011, uh, I really enjoyed the block. I really loved it. Uh, I had a lot of the uh, classic uh, shows from, you know, all that. Keen and Kel, uh, among others, were on the block. But, uh, you know, as time went on, the block started to get a bit stale. And then, you know, it got more stale. And then, you know, nobody watches the block anymore because it's just the same shows every night. You know, it's on the weekdays, it's Hey Arnold, uh, Rugrats, Cat Dog, and another episode of Hey Arnold. And then on the weekends, you get two episodes of Rocket Power and two episodes of Cat Dog. And it's like, you know, Nickelodeon doesn't care about the block anymore, so that they were just going to put, you know, those same shows on every night and, you know, start to get old. And, you know, people are going to eventually get tired of watching the same shows every night. Uh, but the Splat, uh, really looking forward to it, really excited for it. Uh, I just hope the, the block doesn't go in the same direction as the 90s or all that went. But, you know, just really looking forward to this block. Uh, but uh, it's going to be a uh, eight-hour block from, like I said, from 10 at night to 6 in the morning. It's going to be every, every day, you know, Monday through Sunday. And uh, it's going to be, the when the block launches on October 5th, next Monday, it's going to air like all the first episodes of uh, other, you know, of classic Nickelodeon shows. And uh, what the block consists of, these are the shows that are going to be on the block uh, that they announced. Uh, all That, Angry Beavers, Are You Afraid of the Dark, Cat Dog, Ugh, cat dog. Ugh. Clarissa explains it all. Hey Arnold. Hey dude. Which I don't know why that's this is gonna be on the block. Originally the show started in '89, but you know it had a short '90s uh, short run in the '90s. But I enjoyed Hey Dude. Uh, that's another show that they aired on the '90s or all that block uh, when it started. Uh, so, Hey Dude, Keen and Kel, Ren Stimpy, Legends of the Hidden Temple, which uh, never really watched the whole show. Uh, it was never one of my favorite Nickelodeon shows. I know I'm going to get a lot of hate from people uh, who liked, you know, Legends of the Hidden Temple, but, you know, just it wasn't a show that I watched a lot, uh, that I didn't watch, you know, the whole show. Uh, also, they're going to be showing Rocco's Mar Life, Rugrats, Salute Your Shorts, and The Wild Thornberries. And eventually more other uh, 90s Nickelodeon shows will probably follow in the, uh, the block. But they did announce uh, some stuff that they're going to do for the block. But like I mentioned, October 5th, next Monday, they're going to do like a first episode uh, thing with classic 90s Nickelodeon shows airing their first episodes. And then on uh, October 12th, it's going to be a Rugrats week, you know, Reptar week. And then 19, we'll focus on uh, 
stoop kid centric episodes of Hey Arnold, which I don't know why they would do that. There was only one episode uh, that dealt with stoop kids. So uh, also they're going to return uh, retro programming stunts on the block like you pick. They're going to do the Super Toy Run again, if any of you remember Super Toy Run, which is a uh, thing that they did in Toys R Us, uh, where they had to the, get all the toys in like a minute or so. And then and then they're going to be doing Nick or Treat. Now, uh, from what I heard, Nick or Treat was uh, something that like you would call in and, you know, probably like win some stuff or I don't know how it was, but basically from what I heard, you called in and did something uh, for the Nick or Treat. And, uh, yeah, let me see here. It says the week of October 26th, quote, yeah, this is when Nick or Treat's going to, uh, you know, debut on the block. The week of October 26th, callers can once again phone in and make their way down a poorly computer animated neighborhood in, oh, well, in the hopes of winning wonderful prizes. All right, so you win uh, prizes. Uh, although one must imagine that Super Soakers, Game Gears, and Lifetime Supplies of GAC don't exactly cut it anymore. <laughs> that's cool. Uh, but, you know, that's what's going to be featured on the block. Uh, also, they're going to they're gonna play those uh, those classic 90s Nickelodeon bumpers. You know, like what we saw with the Nick, 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 you know, those bumpers uh, that we haven't seen in a really long time. Uh, which, that's really cool. It's kind of bring us all back to us watching Nickelodeon as a kid and seeing those bumpers and the shows. Now it just feels like the 90s again. And then also they're going to be debuting uh, also in October uh, emoji keyboard of uh, Nickelodeon of Nicktoon characters like Hey Arnold uh, saw one that's going to feature like Reptar uh, but it's just going to be emojis uh, thing where, like if you send like a text you could send like the Nicktoons characters so but yeah so I'm definitely looking forward to the splat uh, debuts next Monday at 10 o'clock on Teen Nick so fire up your DVRs you know record them watch them and it's just gonna be fun it's gonna take us all back to the 90s again you know us as a kid watching uh, those classic 90s Nickelodeon shows. So, but yeah, so like I said, definitely looking forward to the splat. Uh, hopefully, like I said, it doesn't go in the same direction as the 90s or all that, where they just air like the same shows every night. Hopefully, they can rotate uh, the shows. You know, like if a show like gets to its final episode, you know, take off that show and then just air another, uh, just air another classic Nickelodeon show until they're. Uh, series one is over you know that's how I, I would hope they would do that so but yeah so the splat like I said definitely looking forward to it uh, like I said uh, next Monday 10 o'clock p.m. on T Nick runs from 10 to 6 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. so yeah so uh, that's it for this video uh, let me all know what you think of this block uh, you know if you're excited for it if you know, if you think it's, you know, going to be okay, if you think it's going to be good. So, yeah, so and also tell me uh, what you th what your thoughts of the 90s are all that block. You know, like, did you like it when it first started? And, uh, you know, did you end up hating it as, you know, the block went on? So, yeah, so let me know what you think of all this. Post your comments, you know, in the comments box down there. I would love to hear uh, what you all uh, have to say about this. So... Yeah, so that's it for this video, and until next video, I'll see you all later.